Hello and welcome back. We are at the backside of this very southern castle, Castle Morn. Uh, we just dropped down there and now uh, we are, well, not stuck here because we can teleport back to the beginning, of course, but let's just explore this way. There's a message saying that an item ahead and seemingly we can get there. Interesting. Okay, we could drop down there as well. And there's a hole in that grating, I see. There's a blob, which is probably weak to fire, as they usually are. Um, is there a seam there? Mm, no, then let's go this way. There's a spirit and a beast. Be wary of up. Maybe when we go outside, that's what they mean. Oh, a blob. Oh, perfect time to try this. Perhaps not as weak as I hoped it would be. Uh, still better to use this, I think. No. I can oh I can cancel okay please help me I'm of noble blood what the hell is getting appraised if those hideous mongrels eat me I'll be forever marred anything but that please think of the disgrace interesting oh let's thank this message Backstab didn't work. We'll explore that way in a bit. Oh no, I misjudged. We should have dropped down there. Oh well. I think it's worth killing these. I mean, they might drop something special, right? That's the wrong uh, thing. I'm guessing this torch is mainly for those people who do not have pyromancies. Like myself. You know what? I think it's better if we just uh, go back up and uh, do this all over. To get that item. Now Morn, the name Morn was mentioned in Dark Souls 3. And uh, he was the he was somehow related to like the church, I think, and Aegon and Irina. Oh, another key, nice, very nice. We could also go back to the very beginning to finally check that door because I think we have plenty of these keys now. Oh, seemingly they are holding their head. As if they are covering their ears. Oh. You think maybe... Whatever is co causing the, this chiming is the case, like that ball? Oh. 
I don't know, should I kill this? I guess. One of those guys. Cannot jump down this way. But we could certainly jump on the roof. Unnecessary. Oh, I missed the butterflies. chest twin bay laid talisman for dual wielding perhaps enhances final hit of chain attacks talisman depicting a twin blade and a compressor enhances the final hit ending of a chain of attacks the twin blade technique is a tradition of the confessors who closely guard the secret of how they preserve the momentum of their attacks. Thus is the final strike of their onslaught all the more deadly. That would be good if I'm like uh, using the spammy weapons. I do wonder if it would work on such a thing as a rapier. Cannot use the horse. It wasn't that hard. That's a boss. Okay. Let's see its moveset in this one. Special is a kick. Huh. Alright. I always found the whip to be more like a meme weapon. 
and I would use it in my offhand, mostly against uh, players. How many souls we have? Not enough. Now, seemingly we can also do drop down range battle because. Oh. Oh, I see. It's hard to backstab this guy. I feel like. I'm not spamming the attack whenever I try it, yet it doesn't work. I guess I'm not at the right spot. So you are just supposed to go down the ladder. <laughs> Probably people who just wanted to run straight across. Cross? Is that... Is that the painting guy? I figured. Hmm. Is it me or the crabs, the big ones? Seems quite a bit easier than before. Or maybe it's just the fact that I'm probably a bit higher level than I am when usually reaching the swamp. Thank you. I think I will trust them this time. Uh, okay. Suffering. Sinner required a tri wolf. The wolf summon, you mean? Wait, do I have a wolf summon? I do not. Could we have picked up a wolf summon? Can't really record. Let's get this off and. Uh, just for convenience sake, put up the Warhawk. So I feel like I might use that. Leonin Misbegotten. Jeez. Bad idea. Stamina. Drink. Okay, I think it's time for a summon.
Get him, bird. Shit. Crafted blade, great sword. It has, okay. So it seems like they have like sort of a rarity icon, no? Because that had the legendary symbol. It's a colossal sword. Oath of vengeance. It's a boss weapon, a unique one. The storied sword of Castle Morn, a revenger's weapon. It is burdened with oceans of anger and regret. One of the legendary armaments, a lone surviving champion from a country now vanished was so determined to continue fighting that he claimed the sword of an entire clan of warriors. And the skill swear an oath upon the greatsword to avenge the clan, temporarily raising all attributes for, certain, for a certain duration. While the oath's effects are active, poise will also be increased. Seems quite good, to be honest. On the description, it also needs 40 strength. Which I think is probably our highest. It's even higher than the golem's halberd. Wait. Wait a minute. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? George. This is the weapon of George. It was like, you know what's cool? Thrones made out of swords. But you know what's cooler? A sword made out of swords. Oh. Okay, I am not sure if I'm wielding it like this because I do not have the strength. Oh wait, how do I use the skill on it then? Maybe then I can't test it. I don't know if this was a I, I I have a feeling this might fight look like even if you can wield it. Is that after all it is a colossal weapon. I don't think it allows me to use the skill. That would be the skill. Or maybe I just don't have the mana. I mean FP. Let's see. We need like 2k XP, I bet. Yeah. Okay. Cool, cool. Um. Let's use one of these. We need more. More strength. Actually, let's do more endurance this time. Because it's getting to the point when my equip load is getting uh, to the max. Let's see. Anything else around here? Visions of wool? Is it talking about the... Uh, Dark Souls 1, the Asibos. Sif? Was it called Sif? Maybe? Then I think this one is talking about uh, the Bloodborne one, the Cosmos one. Forgot his name. 
so many people are trying to jump on that. No, I don't know why they why don't they just do this? <laughs> wait, wait! I saw that. Okay. So I assume now. We just go back to the first one and uh, explore what is left. I think this was probably the boss of the arena. Uh, not the arena, the, the whole uh, dungeon. But you never know. One thing I uh, do wonder is that uh, the ability to get into the route table, is it uh, specific to that bonfire that we visited or is it just based on something else? And we had to head back to the wall and all that. Guess we can skip the the beastman over there. I really like that counter, needless to say. you do a backstab on this? No. Oh, shit. Still no unique drops. there was like a couple more places that we could have gone before so this was the drop done but was there anything before this though why does it have glowy eyes did someone die to this okay so i think that was the way how we go up on the top of the wall? Oh no, maybe we have not been there at all. Let's see. I don't think we have been there. You get there by jumping off. No, no, no you can go around, I think. Oh, look. Confirmed, it can drop the helmet. It's a naked guy. <laughs> Half naked guy. This one will probably land soon. Come on. Oh man. There we go. Can you destroy this? Yes. Okay, oh, but you can also climb down right here. So what did we do before? Oh, I jumped down right here. That was the end of my exploration. Of the wall.
I caught a glimpse of the end of the message just before this happened. I think it said be wary of the right. That is the tower, I believe. Yes, that we explored. Yeah, you can do that, I guess. Or you can use this ladder. No? Okay. I help. Yo, careful. right at the beginning oh a man what's that helmet and that weapon okay let's talk to you uh, there's a face I've not seen before I'm Edgar warden of this castle as ordained by Lord Godric himself but you can see how things have turned out. The menials have all rebelled. They gave me good service, or so I thought. But it seems it was all an act. Foul creatures, as it said. And true enough, they're foul inside and out. I'm sorry to disappoint you. But whatever you've come here to do, I'm afraid Castle Morn won't hold much longer. Take this by way of apology. A twig. Now then, away with you. You've no reason to risk your neck dawdling here, eh? Now then, away with you. You've Fine. no reason to. Is this suggesting to kill him? Hmm. Better not. So how did we get up uh, before? I think that was the way, right? Oh, I can't uh, can't get on the horse. Yeah, I went that way. I guess I can just ignore these guys. Okay, I went in here. I do like uh, how many... What should we call it? I do like how many NPCs we encounter. And I hope their sto storylines uh, extend later on. Look at that guy sneaking. I think he's through like a bomb. Did I go up here?
Yeah, I think that was the progression way. The reason I keep parrying is because that is the same uh, combination you have to do because uh, when you want to counter. Huh? Oh. I do not see any Chinese. Deserved. All right, I think we can leave this place now. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it was just two casals or almost three. Doesn't really matter, does it? Oh, and the golem stayed dead. Right. I think we explored the beach before. Explored over here. So why did the guiding light lead me here exactly? I guess it led me to this boss. I don't think we visited this place. I would rather go there on foot. Yeah, I think it's that uh, church right there. Or that tower, rather. Oh! That's a seed 3, I think. Which means we can get a plus 1 uh, flask, I think, because we already they have uh, 1 seed. Nice. me see over here anything near the edges oops yeah I think we've been here to go this way and then to the left I'm not sure if we will be able to climb that mountain from this side uh, I don't know doesn't seem like it I have been here, I remember now. What the fuck? That's a regular bad. Was it here? I don't think it was here. When I rode up here. First bad. Oh. Stank it.
I think I did this before as well. Can't recall. No, 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 I didn't go this way. Yeah, it leads to like this mountain top, I believe. There's a shack as well. Or something. Oh, a different one. Oh, no. What is wrong with these rats? Do they explode? Hmm. No NPC? Interesting. I hear more rats in the woods. Anything on the roof? Eye of Yellow. Yellow Amber. Found in lands affected by frenzy. It's this one. Consumable. Grown in lands affected by frenzy. Sharp fruit bursting with ripened pulp. Grown in lands affected by frenzy, it's used for its pain relieving properties, though it's also known to be dangerous a dangerous intoxicant. So I'm guessing the red eyes just means frenzy. We've been here, right? On the other side of this. This was the area with the lightning. Yes. More rats. Oh! What the fuck? Oh no. Fucking lock on. I want to see if there is a control option. This one. I think this should help. Set the, whether the camera automatically avoids walls. Then maybe whenever I like uh, lock on, it won't do that. Yep, another tear. The f 
Flame of Frenzy. Oh, I guess that was the spell that that uh, villager used on us. Incantation originating from the maddening three fingers. Causes the yellow flame of frenzy to burst forth from the caster's eyes. Charging increases the range of the burst. The flame of frenzy deals damage and causes a buildup of, ma build of madness. This incantation also causes buildup of madness in the caster and is only effective against tarnished. I guess other beings don't go mad. What it implies? Oh, we seen a person doing the same pose. Where they, where they were uh, trying to pop out their eyes. Remember, and it was like here's a grape for the maiden. Oh no. They do seem to be clueless about each other so far. I don't even know if I have to sneak. Flame crest wooden shield. I guess I can read it. Uh is it if I do it from the equipment menu? A tall medium sized wooden shield, life for its size and easy to handle, carried by soldiers of the village that is afflicted by frenzy. The yellow flame is the symbol of the affliction, serving as a warning to those who might approach the village. Oh no, I'm going mad. I wonder what madness does. I assume it kills you, just straight out kills you, in some weird way. Try attacking, really? Okay, screw that guy. Again, I was just trying to counter, didn't work. That's it. Ailing village. Okay. A few more of those ruins, I see. You can make out quite a lot on this map. That I haven't really realized before. Oh, I think that's a bonfire. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, 
how much we need to again. Okay. All done. Let's see. I think I'm going to allocate the back one to mana just in case we need it. Because we were doing fine with six. But sometimes I think I would still like to cast spells. All right, we didn't go down the crevice. What is that? Oh, just a tree. Whoops. Oh. Did this guy just spawn in while I was looking at the the telescope or maybe they were just all laying down and I did not notice before could be Okay, did we see this house yet? Is this just the same church, I guess? Is it? I think so. Okay, let's teleport back. Oh, never mind, because I'm in combat. Then let's just... Let's just run away. He's probably fighting the knight. Oh, we can take a shortcut. Convenient. Oh, oh, oh! Great turtle shell. So this is where those people got it. I will... Huh? Now the golem respawned? Anyway, yeah, we just put down uh... That's so loud Can I clap? Yeah. Let's see. Oh, it's a medium shield. It has the ability Barricade Shield. Shield fashioned from a great turtle shell. The natural curve helps it contend with foes attacks. The turtle is a symbol of tirelessness. And the shield boosts stamina recovery speed. Oh, so that's why a lot of people were wearing it. I mean, it makes me heavy, sadly. Now I truly look more like a ninja turtle, don't I? With this helmet. Anyway, I prefer the... Wait. Wait. I guess I can change the skill on it though. What does this do? What's barricade shield? Skill made famous by Sir Nightheart. Focus your energy. Into the shield, temporarily hardening it to deflect greater blows. Actually, that doesn't seem too good if you never want to parry. For now. Oops, wrong one. Let's go back to this. Okay, now what do we do here, though? 
Ah, here. Can I see the golem from here? If it's the same one? Fuck! <laughs> Never mind. He sees me and uh, that's all what matters. What's this? Oh, just water. Seek three wise beasts. Oh, there. Oh. Okay, one is a turtle. Or this is rice. Okay. Whoops. Come on. I assume they are probably around here, right? I think the next one is the hole and probably the last... Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Ah, thank you. Okay, so one was forward, one this side. So maybe all of them are a turtle. Wait, was this the one? Surely not. Oh, it's here. Hiding. The seal opened. Wait, what? Okay, weird. I couldn't lock on. And that was very strange. This has a similar interior to a mausoleum. Or that other place that we explored. Remember there was that other tower that I thought was the church? Here an all still. They are generally considered wise. Let there be magic. You think this will teleport? Praise the boss. Oh, because he was... <laughs> I see, I, I see. That's actually pretty clever. Because he was behind the desk at it and... Um, that's the whole joke. Yeah. Oh, nice! Memory stone. 
So now we can equip an extra spell. It's actually really useful. I like how that works. I actually really like that they changed it. Alright, and these are not called gargoyles, they are imps, because uh, they are called imp statues, right? So the enemy type that we encountered in that one early catacomb is also an imp, I, uh, I assume. One of these. Should I read the description on this? Oh, it's not an upgrade material? What is it then? What's a starlight shard, if not that? It's in my main... It's a consumable. Oh. An ephemeral sliver that gives off a pale blue glow. What remains of a passing flash of starlight. A prized item that was once used in the eternal city as an ingredient in intoxicating droughts. Okay, and that is the place where we already visited so then i wonder if this other tower also has some secret the converted tower although it does say it's converted okay then i think the last thing to check out are those uh, the convoy in the middle not the convoy but sort of it is a convoy that was destroyed and perhaps something here okay there is a bonfire again Oh. Now, what is that about? Oh, I guess I could memorize an extra spell if I have one that I can use. Let's see. Which one? All oh, right, this one. The assassin spell. Cannot use that though. Hmm. Or this crystal burst. Let's uh, try this, I guess. Probably not gonna ever use it, but. This undead. Yo, they they are doing the gravity thing, eh? What? He summoned the rock. Oh, they are not on that. Uh oh. Oh, this is the same kind of guy. Get staggered easily. I feel like this uh, the claimer is too slow. Guess I can keep. Oh shit! Guess I can keep staggering him. Gravity stone chunk. Seems like an ammo item. Oh no, it seemed like shit.
there is one more. It was in here. It's a consumable. It uses FP to cause a gravitational explosion. Interesting. Seems like this guy can drop something else. Gravity stone fan. Uses FP to emit fan shaped gravitational shockwave. Shard of a rock found in the wake of a meteorite strike. It is imbued with a particularly weighty magic. The desperate ones who scavenge for these shards dub themselves Star Colors. Uh, what's this? Possibly just another way up here. See a dragonfly. what the point of this was oh right here impalers catacombs Let me check if I have any new armor pieces that are interesting. This is only related to FP. Deep red hood that covers the whole head worn by soldiers sent to the penal colonies who were required to keep their faces hidden. We read that one. Don't have any new head armor. I do have a Caden armor but this is worse. In every aspect than the exile armor and we do have this aristocrat uh, garb as well oh oh this is simply just the armor of the archer dudes Caden okay, gauntlets also worse kind of interesting we didn't come across many armor pieces so that's me Seems like so many people start with the prisoner for I think the same reasons that uh, they just enjoy the helmet. Now of course I could switch but I think at this point... Well actually we do have a club right? I have a large club right? Yeah yeah yeah. Uh, no, a large one, yeah. Or the anchor, I can two-hand this, right? Can two-hand this and uh, take off the shield. Actually, take off the torch, put back the shield. Can I still be medium? Yes, I can.
I mean, this place is valid enough, but might as well put our little lantern on. Wait! Oh, because this does piercing damage, right? Wait. Yep. What an absolute shit weapon. Oh, no, 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 because I wasn't two-handing it. Whoops. Still, not great. Give me a second. How about a club? It did slightly more than a claymore, so it allows us to two hit them. How about uh, the pickaxe again? No. But it does do big stagger, so let's use the club. Uh, I think. Can I build this with two hands? Does this work? Think it does? Yeah. Let's try this as well. Look, my whole theory of like them taking uh, uh, more damage by crushing weapons might be completely wrong. You never know. So even for just a sake of experimenting, I think it's worth trying out different things. Uh oh. Oh. Crouching required ahead. Where do you go? What? I don't understand. Is there something in the corner there? Don't seem to be. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think I know. No? One, two, boom! Can you go under it? Wait a minute. Was there any other way? I think that's where we came from. Nowhere here, yes. Hmm. Is it like something really obvious? Legs ahead and then backstepping. Oh! Thank you. Oh, that's funny. I'm dead. Too slow. I don't like this weapon against these guys. Um, 
What was I the claymore? Yeah, I think using the claymore over here is just fine. Wait, are these endlessly rising? Please help. Oh, I think they are. Let's see. Yeah, okay. The root resin. Here we go. That opened up the boss room. Ouch. Not that. Oh, nice. Okay, let's sit down for a minute. Visions of Pack, therefore try taking on all at once. I see, I see, I see. I have my own pack. Okay. I had my own pack. Shit. Shit. That's annoying. New plan. I need like a summon that is uh, not like a slow ass uh, undead, basically. Can I equip my magic wand without being heavy? I actually can. Because of the scaling, I know it says that sorcerer scaling is like lower than this, but I think this is still better.
fuck. Damage human ashes. Oh, can summon the little goblins now. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Back to the entrance. I think we got most of our summons from like uh, these uh, mini dungeons so far. Okay, so we are back here. And then hmm, there is something else on the top of this. So before we check out uh, the middle part, finally, because there was some loot there, I remember that clearly. I guess I should have rested at the bonfire. Ah, uh, whatever. That's the same all. If you can even get across from here. Oh, one of these. Surely these things serves, uh, serve a purpose. There's probably something with them. Like they are so out of place, if you think about it. And they look in different directions as well. Like why is it facing this way and not like off the side of the cliff? Ah, who's this? Nice, another key. So that was the Ballista Bridge as well. It's our way across. Oh, there is also a bonfire right down there, but first let's check this. Are these those same flowers? Yeah, no. These are just floor flowers. I don't know if you can kill them actually. There is a ballista or something at the top. Maybe. Oh, will this teleport? Let there be ball. A hand ballista? This is what I was curious about. Uh, how does one use a hand ballista? Well, we can't. It's too heavy. An unconventional ballistic device modeled on a weapon used to besiege castles, only capable of firing great bolts. Perfect for reckless acts, such as storming a castle or facing an entire army, army alone. Uh, does it mean I can still fire it? 
Go. I guess not. I mean, you have to admit, it looks sick. I love the weirdest weapons. Even though most of them are really bad. What is that over there? I think it's this one. South of the lookout tower. Hmm. Trying to see if he missed anything that stands out. Tower of Return, no, I think we. Yeah, we checked that place pretty thoroughly. Okay. Time for that bonfire then, maybe? That's where we got there in the first place. Oh. Oh, you can kill those. Never mind. I'm dead. Uh... 5.6k souls may be worth getting back this early on. Oh man. Problem is they will be on the other side. So we go up first, right? I guess I could fight these again in case for like rare do drops. Kinda wanna do that. I wonder if uh, I kill enough, will it summon one of those guys again? Hmm, no, that was a one time thing. Oh. Really? Oh man, I I figured that would be safe. It wasn't that high. I did that on purpose. Okay, one more time. Let me go there and control the It's comfortable. 
Oh, wait, you can do a heavy attack? You can! Whoa, I didn't even know that. How do you do that? Oh, shit. That's cool. Okay, is there a spot like surely here? Yeah, and then here. Okay. I kind of want to do this part because this is closer to the bonfire. First. Nice. Oh, we got their armor. Tree and beast circle. You think it's better? It is actually. And it's heavier as well. Safer this way. What did it say? Try right and then campsite right. Okay, that is actually a good hint. Now let's do this finally. Is this a person? It is a person. A lady. Hello? Is somebody there? A uh, blind one. Your ear for a moment, please. My name is Arena. I've escaped from Castle uh, Morn to the south. The servants there have rebelled. I... I can't be sure what it is. My eyesight's been weak since birth, you see. But I swear I heard frightful howling from all over. My good father secreted me out the castle, but decided himself to stay. He says it's his duty. As commander. So, needless to say... Her name is Irina, she is blind, and Castle Morn is the place, wha what it's called, like, needless to say, it's very familiar, right? So because no one put down this obvious sign, it's time for me to get some free heals. Um... Concepts is there one of like familiarity? Ah, drags. Drags can fit her, but not sure how many people remember that. Ah, it's like, oh, yeah, yeah, ah, 
There was another one. And then we can use the... It's like a dream. Ah, seems familiar. It's like a dream. Oh, the signs are there now. I I fear for father's life. The servants are full of wrath, filled with hatred for every one of us. They've since come for every one of the companions I escaped with. They haven't spared a soul. I fear it's no different at Castle Morn. Please, I implore you. Would you mind taking a letter to my father? Oh. At the castle. My soul wishes that he escape. Even if his honor should be the price. Please, I just want him to be safe. Then please, take this. Irina's letter. Deliver it to my father, who remains in the castle, if you please. How did she write it if she's blind? Please. Or almost if blind. You mind, I mean, that's kind of true. Deliver the rude. letter to my father at the castle. He can be stubborn. But I'm sure he'll come around. It's not like... But, you know, it's... It's, I'm just saying it's harder to like not mix up the lines, I guess. I, I wanna read the... sorry. Didn't expect that. Ah, sadness. Okay. I was even going to visit his father uh, if she didn't uh, request for us to do so because I figured he might have a different dialogue now that she met the daughter. We have seven keys. Damn. Where's the letter? Oh, here. Letter given by Irina, addressed to her father, the commander of Castle Morn. Gorgeous silk handkerchief, lightly stained with blood. Words can be made out with him. What did it say? Is it always fingers? Let's deal with the footman first. Shit. But I'm one of you, can't you see? But oh, that's not frenzy. Is it like... It, that dog gave us two sev uh, yeah, 270. Yeah, okay, so whenever they glow, it just means that they give us extra souls. Hmm. Whoops. Not what I wanted. Hello? I wanna enchant my weapon. Oh. How come he's not hostile? No drop. I guess they could drop their weapon. If the golems can as well. A morning star. Nice.
Oh, it's there. Ash of War, mighty short. I keep forgetting that these uh, thingies, the scarabs, can... Uh, and in fact, a lot of the times they do give uh, Ashes of War instead of the upgrade materials. So I think this is still the best way to get to him. Because he's on like the far side of the wall. Like we have to like go around to get to him towards like all the battle. I kind of wish we met her earlier. Then she would have given some purpose to like our adventure. Like back here. So to be honest I feel like kind of lost like going in here. Besides just like you know random loot. Because the guiding light does seems to direct us this way. But still not sh entirely sure about what reason is there to come here besides like uh, random loot. And George R. R. Martin's sword. What the fuck? Okay, 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 okay. They are out of sync. What the fuck? can't do shit, man. This is what it is, the, the claimer is just too slow for the attack rate of the doggies. Holy shit, that's annoying. I think I just go this way. I don't know if I can just ignore the flying ones. Hopefully they will not follow me. I think we are safe. Now then away with you. You no reason to risk your neck, Godlin, here, eh? I see. From Arena. Thank you. I mean your debt. But I can't leave yet. Even if the castle should fall. As commander, I must remain. To ensure the treasured sword of Morn does not fall 
into the wrong hands. I have the sword. If you see Arena, do tell her that her father will come for her once he's fulfilled his duty. If you see Arena, uh, do tell her that her father will come for her sir? once he's fulfilled his duty. Hold up. This is the sword, right? Yeah. Look, look, look what I have. If you see Arena, yeah. her father okay. Will... That's awkward. I don't know. Um, let's try going here first. Seeing if uh, there is something in the boss arena, perhaps. Just in case. I don't think so. Okay. Go back to here. Hold up. Let me look at the map after loading. Do the guidelines disappear once you complete? No. Let's talk to her again. Maybe she will convince us to... Oh. She's dead. Uh, yep, that is clearly, so that's why the sadness was here. No, the message, but the, but it is, didn't expect that, I see. I see. Okay. I didn't really expect it either. I'm just going to see if I can tell her dad that she's dead. And this time we do this. I wonder if I can kill it just as easily with this rapier. I can, and I got the helm. Oh, I forgot about you. Let's see, uh, slightly better physical but way heavier. An oval helm large enough to cover any head, very heavy and very hard. It reduces damage from headshots and the impacts. The inside of the helm is pitch black, <laughs> keeping the crazed warrior within from panicking. Perhaps it's rather roomy interior also helps alleviate feelings of pressure and claustrophobia. Really? Does it now? Beautiful. So, is that an actual effect? Some somewhere says, uh, "Oops." It does say in a new phrase that it does that. Yeah, I think these all work, even though it, they don't show up at the passive effects uh, screen. Oh. 
Didn't know you had a move like that. Um, fuck. I I didn't watch my health. Oh well, another chance to possibly get the pumpkin head weapon as well. I should also send back the elevator whenever I go up. What the fuck? I'm in your debt for keeping the sword from those fallen creatures. I'm no longer bound by duty. Once I've rescued Arena, I will spend my remaining days with her. Shit. Thanks to you, I will be reunited with Arena and devote my remaining days to her. Arena has a gentle nature, though. I only hope it remains intact. Thanks to you, okay. I can devote my arena has a. I only hope that got uh, more sad. I'm in combat. I wanna teleport back and then one more time do this whole round. All right, we didn't check uh, this one. Jesus. 
is this? Okay, um, let's see here. If I raise this to 16, which I cannot, I could get that thingy. Hmm. Yeah, screw it. Okay. One final round, just to confirm that that is where the storyline uh, stops, perhaps forever, perhaps for now. Prina, <gasps> how could this be? My daughter deserved better. The fault lies with me. I chose duty over my daughter's safety. And that is how fate has answered. I'll find them. The foul wretch is responsible for this. I'll hunt them down and exterminate every last one of them. Rest assured, Arena, it will be done. Well, find a foul I'll hunt them best assured. Okay. One more. The reason we are going back here is because we are going to check if he left anything in the place where he was sitting. And then after this, if he didn't, I have another idea. I really dislike the dogs in this game. It's like I think they kind of like upped their attack rate or something. Maybe not. Oh, synchronized climbing, I see. I could have tested actually if I indeed climb faster. Oops. When holding uh, base. And just compare myself to the Phantom. Because he was also holding it. Oh, that you do this using the Fate Sight. The winged site that we got before, but it needs fate to use. Possibly because we didn't kill those enemies though, we won't be able to teleport. random drop from oh no, no i guess that was the drop from the knights okay he's gone no loot yep we are indeed in combat sucks shit Come on.
come on. Okay. Just because we took... Oops. How do I remove this? E. Just because we took the sword, I would like to check if now there is perhaps anything here. No. Okay, we checked. Now back to here. I know this episode is very long, but uh, after this, I think we will wrap this up. Okay, so he is gone. Now, what do you think? Where could we find him, huh? I have a feeling it's here. Just curious which is the fastest way, perhaps. Perhaps this. Although, I think this was on a cliff, right? Put a beacon right here. Okay. Mm, maybe here. Oops. I just want to check this quickly. Maybe he went and fought that big demigod per uh demigod demi human person. Okay, just watch your step. Have you been there? Yeah. Oh, three people. Uh, do we have to go around perhaps? Yeah. Oh, we can jump down right here. Okay. That boss is forever dead, I see. Why am I fat or Oh, because this is a clay mod shit. Mm. Just one more quick sweep of the premises. And I will think about where he could have went off camera. Maybe we'll see him at the round table, not sure, or some totally different location. Either way, I think uh, we will end it here. If you watched, I thank you greatly and I will see you in the next episode. Until then, bye.